you can specify formatting to cells based on conditions. The example worksheet has details of marks obtained by students of a class in a subject. For example, if greater than 90 marks is A grade and 70 to 90 is B grade and less than 70 is C grade, you can highlight the cells with the different colors based on the value in the cell using the conditional formatting. Select the range of cells for which you want to apply conditional formatting. Click on conditional formatting. Move the cursor to highlight cell rules. Click on greater than Excel displays greater than dialog box. Type 90 as value and select green color as formatting. Click OK. You can see cells having values greater than 90 are highlighted with green color. You can apply multiple conditions for the same range of data. For B grade, it is the range is 70 to 90. Select the range of cells again and click on conditional formatting. This time, select between. Specify the values as 70 and 90 and select the formatting as yellow fill with the yellow text. Click OK. You can see cells with the 70 to 90 values are displayed with yellow color. For less than 70 marks, you can specify format as red color text. Select the range of data again. Click on conditional formatting. This time, click on less than. Type the value as 70 and select the formatting as red text. Click OK. You can see the cells less than 70 value are shown as red color text. You should not give multiple overlapping conditions, then the formatting will not be correct. For example, if you add another condition for the same range of data greater than 80 and specify a format, then it conflicts with greater than 90 formatting because greater than 80 values include greater than 92. You can specify different conditions like equal to text containing specific value, etc. You can see those different options there. If you click on more rules, New formatting rule dialog box is displayed. You can select different rule types and specify different conditions and select different formatting. You can also manage rules you have already added. Select the range of data, click on formatting, conditional formatting, click on manage rules. 
you can see different rules you added and the range of data it applies to you can edit the rule and change any values if you want to or you can delete the rule also if you don't want if you want to format the top 10 or the bottom 10 or above average or below average values in the range you can do it click on the conditional formatting and you can see the top 10 bottom 10 and different options where you can format you can also specify data bars you can see the bars based on the values in the cell if you click on the data bars this is how you can do conditional formatting though if you like this video please subscribe to our channel